Hi guys, um, interesting video for me because it's the first time that I'm going to be speaking on camera so it's a bit weird. So um, anyway, what we're going to have a look at today is a viewfinder off a video camera. Um, very similar to this one here which sort of dates from uh, late 90s, something like that. Um, it's interesting because it's got a CRT in it so it's really small. So I wanted to take it apart, have a look and see what it is like inside. So I'll just turn it on so you can sort of see it running if I can get it on camera we'll give it a try ok I'm going to hook this up to my um, bench power supply which um, is um, just over here um, the it seems to want to run on about um, 4.7 volts which is um, easy to do the video source I've actually got it connected up to that video camera from the video out so it'll just display what's um, what's on whatever's coming through there um, I've actually had this apart before um, it's actually it, all, it, all it needs is um, um, the power supply and a composite video signal so it's really really simple um, it's probably very self contained so now let's, um, let's pop the cover off here. So you can see this tube inside. Not much to it. I'll turn on the power. So hopefully I can get a pitch for you. Might be a bit hard to see. job seeing that I think. But still you get the idea. Okay, uh, let's power it off and we'll take this apart. Let's get a closer look. Okay, what I've just done is um, desoldered the uh, the wires that I'd um, previously hacked onto this, so I could plug it into uh, a video source. So we've just got the module now. So a little driver board.
Okay, I think what I'm going to do now is um, disconnect the the actual tube from the the driver board. Okay. Um, well obviously under here is the HV. Got a nice interesting induct there with a bit of ferrite stuck to the top of it. Not a lot on it. The IC is a um, electronic viewfinder driver. HV is a silicone silicone cable which just clips into a little connection on the side. And the next step is to take this apart. Okay, I think I've got this now. And we have the actual tube. See how small this is. About forty millimeters. Fifteen millimeters tube screen size. I think there's another layer on here I might be able to take off.
<laughs> so there we go. I don't think there's really any point pulling the HV part apart. It's probably potted anyway. Probably not much to see. I think that is about it. Thanks for watching.